Hey guys, what's up? Um, today I got in a video on my drawings. Purple Fur Pro 17 ICBR. 11 through 4 inch. Uh, Camel Bruciato colorway, relaced and in baby blue. Uh, really nice lacing. Don't know what kind, but uh, probably a little bit better than Wilson. Not nearly as good as Tanner's, but still pretty thick. If you can see that. In areas it's thin, but that I put that stuff in the heel. Yeah, so uh, like you guys know, um, it's eleven and three fourths inches. It's got the wing tip, which I really like. Um, I'm a big fan of the wing tip. I just like it for some reason. I think it looks good. And yeah, I think it's supposed to help keep um reinforce these finger stalls and keep these. Because a lot of times, I guess there's been a problem with Rawlings and these ripping. I've never had that problem, but I've heard of it before. So this is supposed to just help keep them strong or something like that. I'm not sure. If you guys know, just comment down below. I also heard that it's supposed to help keep the fingers nice and stiff. Uh, after about three years or two years of use from my coach, these are still pretty good condition for fingers. Um, tons of wear, as you guys can see. Really everywhere in the glove, web. I mean, he did use this for two years and he does a pitching lesson, so. Uh, fully sets up on the side after the release. Before, it didn't really. But, uh, really nice glove. Pretty sweet. Good pattern. I love the Pro S, the wingtip pattern. Um, yeah. I mean, there's even wear where he takes ground ball. But, yeah. So, I'll go over the specs of the glove. Uh, as you guys probably know, um, camel trim, binding, left wing, right wing. Um, pinky and thumb lace. The whole glove used to be camel, but now it's not. Um, and then camel stitching right there. And then, uh, the rest of the glove is the fingers are bruciato, the thumb's bruciato, web's bruciato, palm's bruciato. It's got a brown petard sheepskin palm lining, which is really comfortable. And baby blue lace that I did. So yeah, um, it's a great glove. I would definitely get one of these. I, I think these are one of the when these things are new. Like I'll do a video later on the web gym, but you'll see my profile for Pro from Twice CBR. When these gloves are new, they look so sweet. Um, this is so dark because my coach did use the Nikona oil, which does darken your glove quite a bit. Um, depending, like. Sometimes, oh, sorry, when you have the oil, it comes in a little tube, and sometimes it's more liquidy, and when it's more liquidy, it darkens it up a ton, um, but when it's more oil and, like, more solid, it won't darken it up as much, so he must have had it, and it must have been more liquidy, that's why it's so dark, but yeah, uh, fingers, um, uh, inserts are getting pretty soft, but that's fine. Um, they're still pretty good. Um, yeah. I think it looks really good. Um, it's, might start cracking right here. And in there. Not really cracking yet. Right in here, it's perfect, because... You let finger out in there. You can see the stalls are kind of tattered up. But yeah. If anyone knows how to make like a really good finger pen like lizard skin, how to make a good one like the thick wide ones that I've seen people make. I don't know they look weird and I just don't want to mess it up. Or if anyone knows how to make a finger pad in general. Just a cool one, a good looking one that kind of blends in. I don't know. Uh, 
long. Oh yeah, I forgot the lines and the preferred sign are embossed. So here's the model number for the professional player. Uh, this is when they did not put the ID number right there. So the ID number is 568, as you can see. Oh, sorry. Sort of looks like 3, but it's 8. At least I'm pretty sure. Actually, no, it's 563. But yeah, I'm going to take a close. Yeah, 563. Um, date code is EHBB29, so if you use the black horse, um, uh, coding method, you could figure out how, what, when this goal was made. 29 stands for Vietnam, uh, not Vietnam. I totally forgot. I don't know, I forgot. I knew what it meant, but I just had a brain fart, so yeah. Um, overall, great glove. All of Rowling's gloves are great. Uh, I have plenty of them. Um, not for sale or trade. I just like it too much. And, yeah. So, I'll do a couple more videos. Comment some more videos you guys would like us to make. We're kind of running out of ideas. Actually, no, we're not. But still, comment ideas you'd want. And, yeah, hope you guys video. Comment, subscribe. And, hope to see you guys in the next one.